The Knicks 2018-2019 regular season schedule has been released. I'm going to give you some key takeaways and key dates. The schedule features five primetime games and 15 back-to-back games, which would be the most in the NBA. Now, the Knicks start the season at home at MSG, a home game versus Trey Young and the upstart Atlanta Hawks. We already got a preview of the Knicks and Hawks youngsters in the Summer League. Let's hope we see more of this from Frank Nielakino. October 19th, the Battle of the Burrows. The Knicks will have their first road game of the year, taking on the Brooklyn Nets. October 20th, Uncle Drew returns to MSG for one of many battles between the Knicks and the Celtics. You know there's going to be a lot of hype and hoopla about Kyrie's off-season decisions, and it's also a primetime game on ESPN. October 26th, the world champs invade MSG as the Knicks take on Stephen Curry, KD, Klay Thompson, and the Golden State Warriors. November 25th, Coach David Fisdale and the Knicks return to the grindhouse in Memphis as the Knicks take on the Grizzlies. As we know, Coach Fisdale formerly coached the Grizzlies and was unceremoniously fired after only 17 games in the 2017-2018 season. In a battle of the rookies, on December 17th, the number one pick DeAndre Ayton and former Knicks draft prospect Mikal Bridges bring the Phoenix Suns to town to take on Kevin Knox and the rookie phenom Mitchell Robinson. Will it be a merry Knicksmas on December 25th as the Knicks take on the Milwaukee Bucks? Will that be a game that Kristaps Porzingis returns? Now, one of the things that always gets me with the Knicks schedule is the dreaded West Coast trip, and this year is no different. They start off on December 29th in Utah against Donovan Mitchell and the Jazz. January 1st, New Year's Day in Denver against Nikola Jokic and the Nuggets. January 4th in LA against the new LeBron Lakers. January 7th in Portland, Rip City against Dane Dollar, CJ McCullough, and the Portland Trail Blazers, and finish on January 8th in Oracle against the Golden State Warriors, the world champions. January 17th, the Knicks take a trip across the pond to London, where they will take on John Wall, Bradley Beal, and the Washington Wizards. The Knicks will return home on January 21st in a matinee MLK game against the OKC Thunder. January 23rd, Carmelo's back, this time with a new team, as Melo, CP3, James Harden, and the New Look Rockets will invade MSG and take on the Knicks. January 30th, another highly touted rookie, Luka Doncic, comes into MSG along with Dennis Smith Jr., the legendary Dirk Nowitzki, and the Dallas Mavericks. And my last key matchup of the season, LeBron James, the LA Lakers, come to the Garden in a St. Patrick's Day matinee matchup against the Knicks. We already know what happened last year between LeBron James, Ennis Cantor, and Frank Nilakina. Let's see what round two has in store. So what do you guys think about the Knicks schedule? What's your record prediction for the Knicks in this 2018-2019 season? When will Kristaps Porzingis come back? Leave me a comment below and let's talk about it. The problem is if they wanted to add another max player, you basically with, like remember by 2020, you're going to have KP's extension, which is going to be close to $30 million. Yeah, I think yeah, it's definitely going to hit 30 for sure. Right. So you, you would also have Tim Hardaway Jr. Maybe you can trade him by then when it's just one year left. 